This year we've had to be creative about how we can continue to be church together. We've asked members of Lansdowne Church to share with us their ideas for how we can keep making and maturing disciples of Jesus, even in the middle of a pandemic. We'll be sharing these videos with you throughout Advent, and we really hope that they'll get you thinking about ways that you can be involved in this, how together we can be the church together. I wonder whether, like me, you've heard a few too many renditions lately of the song, The Twelve Days of Christmas. Very popular song, frequently sung, that can get in your head and you find yourself going over and over, even if you can't remember what the gifts are on the 10th and 11th and 12th days. It's a song actually that is grounded in long-standing tradition, a tradition of 12 days of Christmas that begin on the 25th of December and run through to the 5th of January. Lots of traditions associated with it. You can look it up on the internet and you'll find uh, a lot of interesting information there. In uh, 2 Corinthians chapter 8 and verse 9, we read these words. For you know the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, who, though he was rich, yet for your sakes became poor, so that through his poverty you might be made rich. We are rich, are we not, in the blessings that we have received through Christ. We are spiritually rich, every one of us who knows and loves Jesus Christ and knows him as our saviour. But we're rich in many other ways too, are we not? Rich generally in our material goods and possessions, rich in our family and friends, rich in so many ways, and many of those riches we'll be aware of and will enjoy over this Christmas period. And with Christmas just a few days away now, it occurred to me that I could make something special of this by focusing on these 12 days of Christmas, beginning on Christmas Day, and thinking about what I could do each day, some way in which I might bless others out of the richness that I possess. And I want to just suggest to you that you might join me in making a special focus of those 12 days this year and doing something each day to acknowledge and to bless others. It might be to pray for someone each day, to call someone each day, to send someone an email or a text. It might be to call on a neighbour, to give them some little gift. It might be to provide some help to someone in some way. There are so many things we can do. We might, like the 12 Days of Christmas song, want to get creative and do something different each day. I'm not sure I would have wanted to receive all the gifts in that song, and if I were to receive them, I don't know what I'd do with them. But can we not take this opportunity this Christmas time to observe those 12 days and every day to make that effort that may only take us a few moments to bring blessing to somebody else and to share of the riches that we have received in the Lord Jesus Christ.